Hi everybody, welcome back to Blood Bowl. Myself, Varex, and our Skaven team. So, last time we had a really good match. Really good match, and I'm hoping to build on that. Get some sort of progression going here. Um, as we go into the team roster, <laughs> two things really. First of all, this person here, Mr. Samuel Jackson, has been two points away from leveling up for about the last five or six matches now and I'm just hoping that he's just gonna eventually because he does plenty of blocks and stuff eventually just get that elusive um, you know knockdown and elusive injury that's it they'll let him level up because you know it's really frustrating seeing that all the time in the footage that you know he's got 29 out of 31 he's like oh my god hurt somebody so Sam start kicking ass basically but here we are just Stephen got to level up and there was a lot of divided opinion about what I should get Jason everything from shadowing uh, to tackle to sidestep but I am actually and indeed sure feet and somebody said don't get sure feet because I never use it but if you watch the last two matches previous to this and I know I don't really expect you to do that I have used sure feet to score touchdowns twice so sure feet probably isn't that bad a, a choice honestly but I'm kind of tempted by leaf as well because um it's different nobody else has it yet but then again nobody has sure feet and oh i'm swaying one way or this so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna roll a die i'm gonna roll one of these dies this is a 10 side die but it doesn't really matter because on an odd i'm gonna take leap on an even i'm gonna take sure feet here we go it is an even so we get sure feet because i i do go for it quite a lot with gutter and it's just to score that touchdown and i'm like you know, a, a square or two away from the end zone. So, boom, that's what he's got. Uh, even more of a uh, touchdown machine now. I know gutter runners are in general, but, you know, with his enhanced uh, enhanced dodging with his two heads, plus the fact that he can catch the ball and run further with it now, as well as his sort of, like, you know, stability block skill, means that he's really, really uh, shaping up to be quite a... Uh, a force to be reckoned with and not so far behind these two now um, in terms of just general awesomeness so let's prepare a match and see who we get uh, we're against the Reichland Reavers the Umans uh, he's decided to invest let's take a look at the Umans they haven't done very well so far they've just got some extra rerolls so two extra rerolls so these guys they're uh, Catchers only have strength two, which is really nice. And this guy has a strength of, sorry, agility of four. So he's basically an elf. So we're going to destroy him um, because he does a sidestep and block and dodge. So it'll be a bit of a pain. So we'll get our tackles on him. This guy uh, block as well. So and dodge. So a bit awkward. The two throwers as well. They have, you know, these guys are the weak point. You know, I'm class seven, strength two. Take them out. It really limits their uh, scoring ability. They have an ogre with block and guard. My god. Um, oh, and two more catches here. So if they start with four catches, that'd be great, because I can just smash them into the ground. Now, blitzers will probably all have guard and plus one strength for their guard. Yeah, they have guard and stuff, but they're normally on the flanks anyway. This guy has dodge, but that's not really... So, yeah, guard and sort of like tackling. So, what you'd expect from blitzers. And linemen tend to be a little bit more... There's one with kick there. Um... Yeah, block and wrestle and such. So sort of an average sort of team, really. We'll see how we do against them. We've got five rerolls. Normally we'd have three, but they use some money against us, thinking that, oh, we need them because uh, the Varats are kicking ass. And we are. We really are doing uh, extremely well. Hopefully we can build on that and continue on that. So let's see. Sigourney will be against the Ogre to counteract the block. Um... And uh, we're going to put our two martial artists, being Jet Li and Van Damme, to, uh, to stave off the catchers, along with Sean Bean uh, with his tentacles uh, and diving, diving tackle. So we're pretty well equipped to deal with this. We have our own guarding hard-hitting players as well to deal with their linemen and blitzers. So, yeah, it should be a good match. I'm not liking abject fear of this. Um, the last two matches have been a bit, oh my god, how are we going to do this? I am going to kick to you, sir. But this time, it's it's a little more even. I can see us doing some things here and working around them and stuff. Because um, they're they're not especially 
bashy, this team, and they aren't especially dodgy either, being you know, humans and all. Jack of all trades. Um, so let's have a go and see. So, Jet Li, you can come back down here. Mickey Rock. <laughs> I always laugh when I see his start line. I can't help it. All right, Sigourney, you're going to be against the Ogre, because I can't really tell where the Ogre is going to be, but I'll stick you there. And, um, you know, Sam in there. So, Jet Li can go there. Um, and damn, you can replace one of these throwers. Through there. Arnie, put you there, of course. Now, I want Sean Bean on to, ki uh, to kick off. So, let's put Sean Bean instead of uh, Mila. I'm going to put you there, sort of thing. And now we got the, you there. And over here, we've got this. And we'll leave Danny off. Danny has. No, I want Danny on because he's got the plus one strength. And he's more sort of useful than Nicolas Cage. Nicolas Cage is quite the uh, touchdown machine as well with jump up and plus one agility. Um, but yeah, gutter runners in general are just freaking amazing. But plus one strength and plus one movement means that he's very good at. Uh, at blitzing, basically, and as they have the ball, that's what we're going to be doing. So, of course, you do have the horns as well, but uh, plus one, you know, plus one strength is better. So, uh, that's what we're going to go with. See what happens. So, his ogre's right next to Sigourney. That's really good. His ogre's called Zug, which is actually a star player in the board game, the mighty Zug. And he's basically just a, a guy who, a big, strong brute he is. The mighty Zug, he was called. The ball is going there. Uh, we can actually re organize our players. I don't really want... Oh, wait a minute. It's doing it for us. Why? Just leave it as it was. I spent like half an hour doing it and now I'm going to do it again! It's like, I don't want to re Look, Mickey's there. Sam's there. Where the hell is Sigourney? Alright, there. That's not where I put anybody, is it? Why? Why do this? Why? Because it has, it has to be specially programmed in. So Sean was at the back, except he can actually go there now. It's, it's quite useful. Thinking about it, because I can get the Pentile tail plus the tentacles on the go. I'll actually form a little bit deeper as well. Um, so I'm going to use this to my advantage. Thank you. But uh, you know, put, yeah, Storm Vermin over there. You know what? Now that I'm thinking about it, Storm Vermin can actually go here, maybe. Get sort of this thing sort of going. So Van Damme can go there. Um, that doesn't look quite right. There we go. Because okay. you got you guys both have sides that don't you? So you can sort of this. Dodge and stuff, but yeah, they have four catches on the pitch, which is quite nice. Um, so if we can stop them dodging through us, just like that. And okay, we'll form up like that since it for since it forced us to change, and we'll see what that does. Basically, we'll just we'll just see different sort of formation forms. Joe's going to go up again. Oh, he gets it. Does of course have sure hands and a jelly four. So he's not going to throw it this turn, which is quite nice. So if he makes a random block now, it'll be quite nice, because his cage isn't finished. But he isn't. He's not that daft. So his uh, blitzers are surrounding the ball carrier. And, okay, with the catcher. Doesn't like... Okay, he's not going to try and run through us with his catchers, unless this guy's going to have a go. No. Okay, good. Oh, my God. Mickey. Stunned. Defender down. Okay, not injured. Get back up, Sigourney. Um, okay. Of course you have guard, so I don't have anything here, but I could move gently to there. Because I could blitz this catcher and just start battering the catchers. And then maybe try for that. Um, blitz there and then move into that square. Move on and possibly people around here and stuff. Leave this vaguely as it is. I might shadow you with him, actually. That's actually quite nice. Because he didn't have shadowing, but you know what I mean. Uh, higher strength and all that. Uh, we've got that there, so... Uh, let's do this blitz and see what happens. Just a push. Bit of a shame, that. But no. Put you there and then blitz with you. What that means is that even if... I'll re-roll it. A bit too early for that. Even if I only get a push, which I should have got knocked down there, move you up, and then I can form up a bit like this and protect here. We've got two people there, and he can stay where he is. And we have Sigourney against the ogre, tying him up, and 
And I could possibly get uh, Tommy Lee Jones a little block there, and then Sean can probably move elsewhere as well. So, yeah, we'll put you there. Alright, good. No. Stay there. So there's there's a lot of tackle zones for there, so I think I don't think you'll be dodging through here, so I don't think you'll be coming down here. So I'm gonna move you, Sean. Vaguely here. Oh yeah, I've got now just spotted that if you knock him down or her down, you just run straight through here. So uh do you wanna move over there, Annie? <laughs> just to sort of like stop that from happening. Something like that. One more. Okay. We just readjusted ourselves there, basically, and thrown a few blocks. Of course, the game is uh, frame rate is tanking for reasons that I do not understand. Ooh. And then this is going to happen. No, because ogres are prone to the bonehead thing. There it is. The rolls a one for any action. He goes bonehead and uh, loses all tackle zones. So it happens a little less often than stuff like Wild Animal, but with Wild Animal, the player does count as still being there, and he still keeps his tackle zones. Uh, with Bonehead, it happens a little, little less often. What's this bloody cage thing going on? Yeah, go on then. Big clump of humans there. If only I had a bomb or a wizard. Oh, that'd be amazing. Oh, God. Okay. Get back in there. <laughs> You're not doing fantastic, are you? But, uh, alright, Mickey. Uh, we'll move you there. So, okay, we'll just move up here and then tie this catcher up again with, uh, Danny. Throw this, both blocked, never mind. Um, so just stood you up before that, Sam, shouldn't I? Okay, we'll put you there and actually get you a two dice block on this alignment. Um, both got block again. So a blitz, a blitz. Mm. Not really got a lot for a blitz here, have I? Could always move you up here, and then I'm really just like chasing them down. But you know, I'm gonna go for it. It's only a guys because of cross. You don't have guard, but you're still free there, aren't you? Yeah, that was. Uh, <laughs> Might just shove you in there, then not blitz this turn. Go on then. Never mind. No. Okay, fine. I wasn't sure about it anyway, so it's okay. Okay, a lot of blocks going on now. I'm just giving him a free block with here, which you know, is not ideal. I didn't, I didn't think that through at all. So. Oops. Two dice. Arc. Oh, it's not my fault. Only a push, though. Only a push. And he's dragging his uh, blitzer out there. Oh. Sam. So if his cage is oh, blitzing with a with a catcher. Interesting. I'm just thinking he's, he's getting his players like bogged down out here and stuff. The cage is thinning out. Yeah, he's still got enough to uh, to rebuild it though, because he spotted that he did. Nice. Now I'm just going to pause the recording and uh, see if it's out of way stopping this because if it is. I'm Gonna uninstall it. So, you know, it's 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 not ideal for for recordings with it. You know, every time something happens, the game chugs to about three you know three frames a second. It's no good at all. There we go. I mean, what I really need to do is just just stop it from ringing all the time and just just you know record when I need to, uh, uh, scan when I need to. But anyway, um, you got tackle, of course, block and guard. Mm. <laughs> I should reinforce this area slightly. If it be down there. Only takes a, a blitz and that's they're sort of taken care of, so. Hmm. Okay, Van Damme, free up the Storm Vermin and knock him down while you're at it, that's good. I'll put you down here. Because they can just go anywhere they want. But if it goes down here, there's only ready for a blitz, so I'm not too worried about that barge in there, and we'll blitz here, and I'll tell you what, we'll just push him over here then and not move up, oh dear, 
and uh, hmm. I think I'll leave you there, Sean. No, actually, this is quite all right. That's quite nice. I'll leave that and I'll move you up here. And again, another just turn. Just, just stopping and waiting. I really should have dodged you away thinking about it. Should have dodged you away there because that blitz is going to go boom. No, he doesn't have tackle though, so that's kind of nice. He's blitzing first. Poor old Sean. He's trying to, you know, just, just find a weakness, find a point where he can run through. A bit like sort of how the Dark Elves play. But uh, so far he isn't. So all he's doing is throwing a blitz, knocking someone down, and then reforming the cage. That's what he's done, like, for four turns now. <laughs> that was a bit... Oh, both down. Thank you very much. And up here. Um, defender down. Oh, dear. Oof. It's a shame. Okay, we'll stand you up. You've got a nice block here. I've got three guys here. And suddenly, if I get rid of that catcher, I can put at least two or three people next to his thrower. And suddenly, and you've got no one down here to catch either. So I'm going to move you up, Sam. And put Stan Sigourney up, obviously. I might try and blitz with you, just to get you in there. And then I can put you there and you there. And, you know, block the here. And suddenly he's in a world of trouble. If this blitz works. And it does. I don't really need you to actually knock him over. Because he's got dodge. I mean, the problem is, of course, this bit here. I didn't think of this. Oh, good, nice one. Okay, sweet. So now he's got him to deal with. Him to deal with. And... Don't miss our tackle. Or, yeah, we'll put, yeah, we'll put our, you there as well. Nice, and we'll have a go with you. Push you there. Don't move up. Then I can block here again. And we'll just leave you there, I think. So now I can also... Um, I've got one dice there, so I can put you up here. Probably just about there, I think. And then Van Damme can get a go at this one again. And well, we actually finally knock him down, finally. Hooray! Suddenly, oh dear. You know, he put one catcher in the way of my big guy, and so I took full advantage of that. His ogre's a little um, out of the way sort of thing. He's thrown his blitz that hasn't worked. He's tried to hand off. It didn't work, but it came back to him, I think. Fumbling around. I think he was trying to hand off there so he could dodge away, but, you know, failed the throw. Or failed the catch, I think. I think it failed the catch, yes. Oh, dear. A bit unfortunate for poor old Sean, wasn't it? But he's, now, he's out of position there. Shouldn't have put him in there. So, Thrower does have... He doesn't have... Um, he's only got block. He doesn't have dodge. Which is quite nice. And I do have two dice there, so I'm going to take it. I should have... Uh, oh, he's saying, saying I should have... Uh, I won't move up. I should have moved up. should have stood you up first. Um, Alright, Danny, I'm standing you up. But you're in against a catcher, so you've actually got the advantage there. I'm going to throw a blitz against this catcher. A block, even. We dodged straight into there. Oh, it's rolled three, and I'm just going to destroy him. Nice one. Hmm. If I can get rid of you. Hi, Jet. Well, you can get next to that blitzer, at least, and stop him from just waltzing in and picking it up. And, of course, we have Jason here. We can just go and get it. Um, I'm actually thinking about putting Van Damme here so Sigourney, or probably more appropriately, uh, Sam gets a block on this ogre. I've been in one dice, of course. Um, so one dice there, so I'm going to leave that. Because you have guards, so... Um, Alright, we'll put you there. Mr. Dam. And we're going to bring around here and hopefully pick up the ball. Go on, Jason. Okay, I've got it. Sweet. And because I have sure feet, I don't mind doing that. So that gives us a little bit of leeway. But again, I don't want him to score because he's already got a million SPPs. And, um... Okay, so I'm going to leave that as it is. Poor Sam. I'll try and dodge you away, actually. Okay. And now I can shove you up here. Okay. 
Good. All right. So what a difference to turn, mate. Suddenly we've got the ball. We're through their uh, through their line, and we set up for a touchdown. But I wouldn't mind, honestly, if Sly gets it. And he's given me a gift there. That's for sure. I'll take another turn to do, but he's got no one with me. So what I might do is go up there and uh, see if I can form some sort of cage around him. Maybe free up Jet Li as well, if uh, that's really too risky. Throw a block here. No, I'm just going to move you up. No. Stupid minus two movement. Hmm. Move you up there anyway. Because I might just hand off to him. I'm going to hand off to him, but I want to protect him as well. So, protect him with, with gutter runs, basically. Um, so, I've got a blitz here then. Okay, well, blitz there. Get rid of him. Jet. Here. And, uh... Bundle the rat. I'll go through here. Oh... Actually, that's okay. I'm going to take that because all these other players are, are caught up and whatever, and I had a more chance of hitting him than him me, except he had really blocked, didn't he? I didn't think of that. <laughs> oh, Arnie. Okay, so... I, I should have done the throw. Oh, but yeah, I was blitzing and blocking and stuff. This isn't too bad. I don't regret this yet by just, like, not scoring, but I really hope that by handing off to him, he'll uh, catch the ball and stuff. Of course... Being, being, being too dodgy for my liking. Too much defender downing for my liking as well. Okay, there we go. So I can do this. This is alright. You stand up. Um, Van Damme? Yes, okay, good. Let's get in there. And oh, you do. Okay, good. So we can pile people up here. Um, yeah, alright, we'll go up there. I'm sure that might be the blitz. If we blitz there, no, 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 this is to be blitz. Um, we'll get him up there anyway. Yeah, because I'm a fucking head catcher, so we're going to kill him. It's alright, it's alright, it's all in the control. <gasps> God damn it. God damn it, game. See, I could score here, but, you know, I'm being an idiot. I'm trying to get... My Storm Vermin a touchdown. Get rid of him. No. Hand off to him. Okay, good. So next time, hopefully, he can just run up and score. Um, hopefully. Move you up there. This is all fine. Just have to see what happens next time. Pretty much just going to have to see what happens next time. I'd love to get you sort of like maybe here, but it's another dodge roll. I could just knock him down for no reason when currently we have the advantage here, so I'm going to leave it. There's only catching the throw in the way. I currently have to remove neither of them because I can just go, you know, around here. So it's always been annoying. If only he had Fend. Need to level up! Need to level up, Sam! Uh, pushed, okay. Okay, stop it. I don't, I don't care about this anymore. I just want to see if I can get a touchdown. <gasps> Push me. Okay. So. Throw a block at him. Push him there. And hopefully... Score. Um, let's see. There we go. I got it. Sweet. Okay. Well done, Sly. Super. Okay, we got there. So that was a risk that was worth taking. You know, it's, it's always a bit iffy when you're like, I don't want him to score. I'm going to wait two turns and see what happens. Half time. God. <laughs> now it's my drive. So if he gets like one more um, star player point, he'll level. So I might just throw a random throw with him or something. Uh, interesting, but no. So, Sigourney, you go there. I'll right, oh, back here, I think. Jet Li, I need on instead of. I don't mind one thrower, but again, you know, if I just want to make a random throw with you, because it's, it's more likely than getting a. Uh, 
you know, an injury. So if I, if I have you receive and maybe throw to someone who's very good at catching. Hello. Um, might be a re-roll, but it'd be worth it if he, if he levels up. So that's what I think I'm going to be trying to do. Um, which alters our setup somewhat. So let's see. So Jet, you can go there. Mickey Rock, you get in there. So who have we got here? No, no, no. Um, Sean did okay. I'm keeping one. So we've basically got him there instead of Michelle. So we still have plenty of rats at the front here. Mickey Rock, so who's so we'll have the U3 at the front, we'll have U there, sort of thing. Hmm, oh yes, and because you're here, I don't have someone over there. Which means you can sort of like run straight past there, but I'm, I'm receiving, so that's okay. I'm, I'm, I'm on the, you know, a, a fence here, so I don't have to worry too much about tackle zones and stuff. So, oh, in light of that, I suppose I might as well just have you two up there so I get diced this way. Okay. Kick it towards uh, the Storm Vermin, please. <laughs> he did. Okay, nice. So the plan, basically... Oh, I could just throw it to you now, I suppose. Throw it, do there, do there, throw it to him. And then suddenly we're on the offense this side. Um, so because I'm going to do that, I'll put you down here. And then I can throw a blitz on this catcher. I'm going to do the throw last. Because he has to pick up the ball as well, and he's not too good at that either, so... Uh, alright, we'll just push you away. Push you away. So of course this ogre has a guard, which is right pin. Oh, I get two dice there from Jet Li, so I'll take that. Uh, and I'll probably just move you sort of like... Actually, I'll shove you against this catch, give him something to think about. Do this. Alright, just a push. That's okay, we'll move up. Um... Here we go. Okay, good. And throw it! Okay, nice. Okay, so he's leveled. Sweet. Superb. He's a bit abandoned out here now, you know. He's sort of like, you know, for now we don't... It's not where we want somebody, um, you know, who's very good at protecting the ball and stuff. So, I'm not going to commit. I'm going to go up here. He's going to have to come to me. And now, I haven't thrown a blitz. Oh, yes, I have. So... Mm, I'm going to do that. I am so going to do that because they're both down. I get rid of the ogre. Yes, nice. And so in doing so, I get two dice here. Come on, Mickey. And Sam needs to go this side sort of thing. And we can move you up there. And Annie's in the way. And we're all very good. Okay. So... Sean is the weak point. Of course, he's not going for Sean. He's going, oh, this, you're getting knocked down far too much with these defender downs. You just run, run right past me. That's okay. Doesn't have the movement to make it happen because I can just go over here. And then these two guys will be all by themselves blocked off by Arnie. So I don't mind this. This is fine. He's not really in the way there at all. Of course, I could just go through here. Hmm. Because he doesn't have many players this side now that he's moved up here. So we have a big big gap here, which of course he's seen. Things are nicely spread out. It's been a, a relatively clean game in terms of injuries and stuff, as in there hasn't been any. Much to my annoyance. But, you know, it means we all have the maximum number of players. And, you know, we both have sort of like an equivalent, if you like. I mean... He's got his, his dodgy players, catchy players, so do I. We've, got, we've both got sort of blitzer types. We both, we, we both have uh, big guys. So it is quite an even sort of thing going on. Um, not too sure what to do about this, though. I think I might just form a semi-cage here with you, you, and you guys. If I blitz you over here. So where can I position you? I'll put you on the square that Jason Statham's on. Okay. I'll put you there to help with the blitz. Put you there to stop that blitzer. Move you there. Put the storm vermin. And slide there. I'm going to get you mighty blow unless anything really awesome happens. 
a bit of it's not a goal for it so that's nice and he does it so that's cool i left these guys out so this better go right and i'm just gonna push they're both the same thing juggernaut but okay we're just gonna push him out the way that's fine push him out the way get him out the way um that's okay and I got you guys can I just have you there dogging that catcher and then I can have you down here. Okay, we might do that. Shove you up there. So I've got a player up here causing them a bit of a bit of grief. Okay. Um, I'm not going to throw any stupid blocks. Which is what this is, by the way. But I managed to pull it off, so that's kind of nice. Put you there. Don't move up. And a knockout. Sweet. Okay, that was better than I could have actually hoped for. And we'll just end that. End it. Okay, interesting. <laughs> Didn't know what I expected. <laughs> it's like, okay, you need to have the ball. Ah, of course, you don't have the sidestep, do you? Oh, interesting. Didn't expect that, but of course, you're right on the edge of the pitch there, sir. Hans von Broken. Appropriate name. And for you as well. Hello, Hans von Broken. Do you have strength four? Is that what you're... No, you don't. You don't have sidestep? No. Why there? You idiots. Um, hello. Hmm. Okay. Someone will probably get his injury now. It won't count. There we go, yeah. Um, let's get rid of him. That was a bit silly of you, wasn't it? Oh, how about a touchdown, Sam? Hmm? Tell you what, we'll try and get Sam the ball. If um if Andan goes here. And go there. And this one goes there. And go there and hand it off to him. Catch it! I know we're not doing very well up here, and this is kinda nice because now he hasn't moved his catch away so I can bash him. Okay, another knockout. Could argue that I'm being a little bit unlucky not getting any injuries here because we've got plenty of lockouts, but I'm not going to mind about that. You know, four knockouts um, and one injury, which he must have used the uh, apothecary. I didn't spot that, but he must have done. Um, but yeah, we'll leave that. This is really nice. And get you a get you a level up, Sam. And if I if I can do that and get two levels up, Sven, very nice. Stop some moving up. Nice! <laughs> I love seeing that. I love seeing a heavily armoured blitzer plow into him and just get knocked down. I know it was like nothing at all to do with what Jason did there, but that was still funny. Alright then. Um, get up there, Sam. You've practically scored. Um, so that's kind of nice. The only sort of issue is this blitzer, so I'll cover you with that. And then you're pretty. Yeah, okay, you've scored. That's so nice, actually. And then batter this catcher there's that injury so you did get that injury after all even though I uh, give you the uh, yeah that throw no worries um, it's all good so now we can really just start to maybe save Sigourney project save Sigourney I suppose because what I would really like to do actually now that I've got a few players free is to get some people down here um Put Sean. Oh God, you, oh God, you don't. Okay, so put Sean there. Put Nicholas here, and suddenly I got two dice on this ogre. Ah, I need to push. Ah, well, it's a, yeah, that's okay. And I'm gonna move up. Put you there. Put you there. And we've got him. We've got him surrounded, guys. Gosh, this blitz has got guards. So it's gonna be an issue. And do I feel lucky? No, because I have been. <laughs> that's, what, that's what Blood Ball does. You're like, you're in a roll. Why? Why? <laughs> Why am I down there? He's like, oh, sorry, I didn't realise we didn't have the ball. And really, he was just avoiding the massacre that was going to happen. What are you doing? Stand firm, so it's okay. Nice. Got nothing. So I'm just going to score. I'm not going to mess about. Oh. And again. <laughs> Go on, Sean, lad. Go on. You're not re-rolling that. I suppose you missed one earlier. I'm not sure, but let's get our level up. So well done, Sam. So maybe Fend, uh, I'm kind of hoping we get a double and get dodge. Somewhere. 
a blocking, dodging, guarding player is freaking awesome. I know that from playing Amazons recently. And, uh, you know, their they're blitzes instantly start with block and dodge and getting the guard, and they're an absolute nightmare. I sidestep them. Oh, oh, oh. But anyway, um, <laughs> the conversation for another time. Like never. Um, okay, so, Sean. Sigourney, go. You're doing a great job, by the way, Sigourney. Um, no, I don't want Mila there. Thanks very much. I don't want that at all. Um, we're going to get Michelle some um, some pitch time and maybe throw... Oh, we'll have Sean on. Sean's cool. Um, I'm not thinking about having Mila. I'm actually thinking about it. Because we're two nil ahead and everything. He might even not have enough players. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. He's got enough. Um, big roster. Okay, so I storm them up there, and then, no, yes, and then, and then I go to runners there, and of course there, as is traditional. Because they're extremely useful. Or should I take Nicholas off? Put Sean on a Van, Van Damme. That's what we'll do. So I'll have one yon. Uh, one yon. Um, Danny, where are you? Yeah. What are you saying, by the way? Bit less dancing, please. This blue ball not a knife. You've been dodging like hell, you bloody... Uh, so we'll set up a little bit like this. We'll put you at the back. So does that mean... Yeah, Sean's not on, so... Uh, I'll just have to kick it right in the middle. Like so. I kind of did that anyway. Right over around his head. High kick, very high. Just right next to him anyway, so no big deal. And he's got the ball. Which is good, because that just means I can take him, take it off him, even sooner. So he's going to go down that way. And that's okay. So we'll put our two throwers on for a bit of variation. Plus, if it does scatter, these two girls are very good at picking up the ball, because they both have sure hands. She needs two touchdowns to level. Easier said than done, of course. Though I'm hoping, you know, maybe to earn a cheeky block or something. Quite hard, because you didn't have block, and I should have got a block first thing. Okay, move the ogre behind your players where I can't get to him. Because, of course, you're protecting the ogre because you're frightened of me. That's in, that's totally what's happening, though, by the way. Wow. What a movement. Movement 8, of course. Quite fast. And match imminent. So, how do we deal with this? Tackles up. I might just blitz here and see if I can get him off the pitch. Um, or at least teetering. Um, so, we'll do that. And we'll put you there. And I might put you up there. Yeah, it's okay. Cheeky. Uh, I'll move you down there to complete the sort of like secondary line that I've got. We'll move Danny up here to be like, well, not quite that close, but to be sort of very annoying. And we're going to see if you can do this for us, sir. Because there's another blitzer there, so... Okay, we'll take that. We'll definitely take that. Oh, he's got a dodge. Uh -oh. Okay, that's fine. That's good. And I'll tell you what, we are going to... Okay, fine. We'll do that instead. Push him up there. And you know what? I am going to move up, because if I don't, and he's on his own sort of thing, it's not ideal for him at all. We'll get the guarding player in there. We do have this secondary line here, so I'm not too worried about my breaking through. And we'll put you there. And I get a two dice here. And if that goes well, which it kind of didn't. Of course, it's Sam, so it's okay. Because I will get two dice. Um, here. And that's fine. So, I have them surrounded. Hello. Oh boy. Oh dear. Not what I expected. Uh, Defender stumbles. That's just dandy. Bye! You're 2 0 down and you're moving the ball backwards. Yeah. Well, I suppose, you know, I've got, I've got two lines here. So, you know, it's quite it's quite nice. Um, oh, of course, Arnie. Arnie, Arnie, where are you? Silly Arnie. Okay, Fend is nice. Of course, then you get to move up there. 
Bye. with that blitzer. I'm going for it. Oh, come on! Alright, alright. Everyone's still on the feet. But I was thinking, you know, and I could blitz with Arnie and uh, and get rid of that blitzer. And that'll help, you know, going forward. But he's wasting his blitz anyway, so, you know, we're both just floundering about a little bit now in the death throes of the game. But it's all good. Yes! Please. Mm. That's annoying. For her next level up, if it, if it ever happens, and I get a double, um, this Prince Isle tail would be quite nice. Minus one and dodge away from her. Yeah, she gets a tackle there anyway, so that's pretty sweet. So let's give up on this blitzing idea, even though fun as it was. Just on the ball. Oh no, it's alright. Last go, last turn, so it doesn't matter, i got three rerolls left, so let's do something crazy! I don't know what that might be. Go on, Jet, kill the Lyman. Isn't this crazy? Oh, so crazy. Wow, how crazy was that? You get an extra turn after me. I might just leave you down there, but you might foul him, so I'm going to get him up and uh, sort of dodge him away, 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 away. Um... <laughs> Should I? Well, I'll tell you what, we'll um, yeah, we'll throw you up there as well so you don't just batter him. Um. <laughs> Who's going to do the deed then? Sigourney? Sam? I suppose... Ah, we'll have Michelle do it. Don't do anything yet. Oh, come on! What's he saying? Stop that straight away or there'll be trouble. Ooh. Scary. Um, I don't really have a lot else to do here. Um, I'll just end my turn. Just hope that poor old Sylvester, um, Sylvester survives. Survives. Sylvester Stallone survives. Oh, dear. He, he went for it. I think he might have been trying to block Jet Li there. It's Jet Li. I'm not sure because, you know, he just moved straight next to him. But he could have been after the gutter runner. We could have been trying for that. This is going to happen down here. This is all we've got to worry about. I'm going to do have an apothecary roll. The game does tend to throw these sort of things at you. Okay. Right at the end. It's like, yeah, you've won. But, oh, look at that. Dead star them. And we've had that happen a few times. We're good. And, and it's, it's finished. The game is over. You've lost. You've lost. It's like, no, I can, I can still do. No. No, you can't. No, you've lost. You have failed, my friend. Failure. 2-0 victory to me. Woo! Woo! And it's... Game. There's nothing else for you to do. <laughs> there we go. It's finally thrown in the towel. So, um... 2-0. I don't think I could have got any more out of that because, you know, he's doggedly, you know, doing his cage all the time. And the touchdowns I got were very, very important. We are going to reroll that. Um, so I only lose 10 grand from doing this. Um... 2 0 victory, 12 out of 20. So a bit of a meh game, really, for them. Their most valuable player was Fat Mitt Brot, who did absolutely nothing. And for us, it was Jason Statham, who doesn't need it at all. And again, really didn't do that much. Yeah, he ran with the ball a bit and passed it. But, um, alright, fair dues. That means he's only 20 away from leveling up, I believe. So in the replay, we can see that, uh, oh, they got injured twice there, but one of them was pushing off um, into, you know, crowd surfing. That's what I mean. Um, but we did get a little pass there, so it's kind of nice. And players of test sticks. Players of test sticks. So, um, so this is low and gets six. One for a touchdown, one for a pass, and two for, well, three for a touchdown, one for a pass, and two for an, a casualty. Um, also, we got three for Samuel Jackson and five for, Jennifer, for Jason. So, again, we're sort of like running low on injuries, um, but... I think we were very blocky at the start of this, getting our two guarding players, and now that the other teams have sort of caught up and they have guard and block and stuff, um, we're getting less and less injuries, which is a shame, obviously, but there we go. Um, GG. And now we have two levels. Best part of the game is two levels. So if this um, isn't anything, I want this to be awesome. I want this to be a double. Please be a double. It's not a double. 
So, I mean, I've got Fen before. Um, I don't know what else to get him. I mean, day player could be nice, but it doesn't really benefit the team that much. Um, so, Tackle, I'm probably thinking. Tackle or Fen. Uh, I might just go with... with or, or Dauntless, indeed. But I do have ta two Dauntless players already. So, I might just go with Tackle. Um, just to... Uh, a bit more extra versatility, you know, when he's against like goblins or elves in the front line and, and you're throwing these blocks with your guiding players, a bit of tackling there wouldn't do any harm. So, a bit more offensive capability as well, and plus it, dodge, it stops him dodging away from the, 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 the line of scrimmage so much as well. So, that's my thinking with that, so that's what I... Gun and done, and sly. Ha <laughs> <laughs> Yes, please! Oh, he's just like the list of vermin that we had. That I forgot what his name was, but he was freaking awesome. And um, he died. And now, oh, plus, oh my god. Yeah, sweet. Oh, that's, uh, hello, Sly, with your uh, strength four. Strength four, tackle and guard. I was thinking mighty blow, but, um, yeah, you know, takes no thinking of whatsoever. I am so pleased about that, because we were really lacking that oomph. I was blitzing so much with... Arnie to, to get those two dice blocks um, that, that Skaven so struggled to do. But now, you know, with all the guiding players I have, plus a Storm of Irma with plus one strength, I mean, that's both offensively and defensively really good because I can stick him next to two players with strength three and he's, he, you know, he's still got his block and, you know, against one dice blocks against him to, to you know, stick him on a, on a flank or whatever. That is so nice. What a level up that was well worth waiting for. Well, we leave once again on a high, and uh, if we check the rankings, we can see that once again we are completely and utterly decimating the enemy, and I don't think at this stage we can um, really lose it. I, I forget how many games we have left to play. Uh, maybe if we lose the next two and the Dwarves win the next two, um, but I don't know whether... I don't think we've played Chaos Dwarves yet, um, other, and I think we've played everybody else. Maybe high elves. I'm not sure. You know, it all sort of like players. Plus, we think, you know, we're talking like six weeks back and stuff. Um, but the Chaos Cup is going very well. We can say that much. So, thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you next time where hopefully Sly will use his plus one strength. And, uh, yeah, we'll we'll start kicking some uh, maybe even, even more ass, which would be fantastic. All right. So, I'll see you next week. Cheers very much. Toodaloo.